Hello and welcome everybody, it's KB here. So first we have a good news for Windows 11 users. Soon Windows 11 users will have new tab feature in Windows File Explorer. Using this feature you will be able to open tabs inside Windows File Explorer. So as of now this feature is only available to Windows 11 dev builds and it is also a hidden feature but there are tons of tutorials out there which shows you how to enable this feature if you're using a Windows 11 dev builds you can actually try out this feature now on to the real spicy stuff how to get tab feature in Windows file explorer on Windows 10 11 or even if you're using a Windows 7 it will work so let's begin so in my opinion the best free way to get tab feature inside Windows File Explorer is by using a Qt tab bar. So this is a completely free and open source application. So basically this is an extension for File Explorer which enables tab feature. So this is available at GitHub which I will put link in the description. You can go here and download this software or learn more about this software. So to download this software just click on releases and after that scroll down until you see assets and under the assets you will see download links for this software and there are different languages for this software actually. So there is a Chinese, German, Brazilian and English. So I'm sure that most of the people use English on their computer. So I'm gonna have to click on EN. So if you use English, then make sure to download the software which says EN English. Okay, so I'm gonna click on EN which will download a English version of this software. Now I'm gonna go to the downloads folder and I'm gonna unzip the software that we just downloaded and go inside the folder and you will see a software itself here. So to install this just double click on it and start installing this just like you install the other programs. Now you may have to wait one or two minutes to get the software installed because it takes some time so if you think that it is stuck on installation don't worry just wait one or two minutes and it will get installed so now it is installed and you can click on finish now open the file explorer if you see no changes no new tabs don't worry what you can do is go and search for control panel and after that inside control panel click on view and after that click on toolbar and enable Qt tab bar. Now you will see a bunch of options and a plus icon which is basically a new tab feature. Now open the file explorer and you can see there is a plus icon to open a new tab. We can click on it and it will open new tab. And if you want to open a folder in new tab you can click on your middle mouse button or mouse wheel button that will open that folder in new tab just like that just click on your mouse wheel button or middle mouse button just like that and it will open that folder in new tab and you will see lots of options added to our file explorer such as new window clone this reload recently closed so this application is basically a extension for file explorer which adds more features the most important one the new tab feature so if you right click on the empty space you can actually access the qt tab bars settings and from here you can customize your qt tab bar so there is this application called files app which is a best free alternative for windows file explorer which actually works really well and it has a tabs feature so just in case if you don't like to install a qt tab bar you don't like it you can also try this windows file explorer alternative and this application is also a complete free and open source application just like a Qt tab bar. So I have downloaded this files application and let me show you how it works. So this is like a best alternative for Windows File Explorer and you can see at the top we have a tabs feature and we can open new tabs just like we will be able to open new tabs in upcoming future update of Windows 11 and yeah this is also a good 
way to get tabs feature in Windows. And you can also set this application as a default Windows File Explorer. You just have to go to the settings and under the experimentals, you can see there is an option set files as a default file manager. So this is also a pretty good option if you want to use tabs in file explorer so that's it hope you enjoyed it i'm gonna put a link in the description for qt tab bar and this files application you can go there and download them and whichever you prefer use them they are completely free so yeah that's it hope you enjoyed it i will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye bye